going to show you all how to clean a rusty bike chain. Now I've been riding my fat bike out in the snow and the wet and the salt and the grime all winter long and haven't been taking a great care of it. So I've started to develop some rust spots and we don't want that. Rust on the chain is gonna create additional friction and wear on the rest of your drivetrain parts and we wanna keep things running nice and smoothly. So it's worth noting that I have rusty spots, but it's only surface rust. It's not the whole chain isn't covered in rust. And if your bike chain has significant rust, is rusted all the way through, then it's gonna be better off just replacing the chain. This is something you can do on your own, or you can take it to your local bike shop. But if we're just dealing with some rusty spots, some surface rust on the chain, we can go ahead and clean that. And that's what we're gonna do right now. First things first, I need to gather all of my supplies. I have a roll of shop towels, but you could use a rag, some bike degreaser, a toothbrush or chain brush, a lime, a stainless steel scrubby, dish soap, and last but not least is chain lube. I'm gonna start out cleaning my chain just like I normally would. I've got some degreaser, I've got a shop rag or a towel and I am going to either spray the degreaser onto the chain or if I really want to go an extra step I can remove the chain and soak it in degreaser. I'm not going to do that. I'm lazy. I'm just going to spray it on. I'll leave it on the chain for a little bit, come back and probably scrub it with a toothbrush and then wipe it off with a rag. If you only had a little bit of rust in your bike that might have done the job just doing the degreaser. If that did not work and you still have some stubborn rust spots, then we're gonna move on to the next step. I've got a stainless steel scrubby and the lime, and I'm gonna squeeze lime juice onto my scrubby and then scrub the chain to remove those stubborn rust spots. At this point, I have got most of that rust off my chain. It's looking sparkly again. And the last step is to, going to be to take my bike outside I'm gonna wash all of that lime juice and degreaser off with some dish soap and some water and make sure that it's super clean. Rinse really well. I'm then gonna dry my chain because if I don't, I'm inviting more rust to come in. And my last step will be to put a good chain lube on there, let it soak in and then wipe off any excess. If you found that video helpful, can you do me a favor and hit like and subscribe I offer tips and tricks and product reviews to help you have more fun on your bicycle. Also, if you are looking to order any supplies online like bike degreaser or a new chain, I really love Jensen USA as an online bike shop. And if you use the link in this video description, that's an affiliate link, which means I get a small percentage of any sales. That helps me pay my mortgage and feed my family. So I super appreciate you doing that. Until next time, happy riding.